Covington police got called to assist a school resource officer around 11.30 Wednesday at Covington High School after a 14-year-old student stormed out of an administrative hearing making threats. The student exited and obviously he was upset from that hearing. So, uh, and his parent was there with him as well in that hearing. Right, right. That's why she was there during the incident. Once in the hallway, the student became belligerent with his parent and school staff as they tried to de-escalate the situation. He began cursing and making verbal threats. He was going up and down the hallway, screaming, shouting, cursing, uh, and being disorderly in the school. The student threatened to shoot officers with a handgun and an assault rifle during the argument. Police say video surveillance from the school confirmed the student never brandished a weapon. However, he reportedly assaulted a teacher during the incident and an officer tased him. After a, a teacher was assaulted, you know, his mother was obviously he was not minding his mother or the other administrators. And so then when he came at the officer, then the officer had no choice but to intervene. The high school freshman is charged with disorderly conduct, assault, assault of a police officer, resisting arrest and threat of mass violence on school property. The student is set for arraignment in juvenile court. And until then, he's released to his parent. Chief Turner says a lack of resources to detain and discipline juveniles in Tipton County is a problem. Whether it be stolen cars, smashing grabs, whatever those are, uh, the juveniles know that we are kind of restricted and do not have a lot of places to, to keep kids under 18. And because of that, they know and it becomes a revolving door that we arrest them and they're returned to a guardian or a parent and then the parent cannot control them. The student has been banned from school property until the matter is resolved in court. In Covington, Alan Self, WREG News Channel 3.